So I just watched the Thriller music video again for the thousandth time in my life. And really looking back at it, this man Michael was a terrible boyfriend. Iconic or not, he literally put this girl through hell dang near the whole video, bruh. So it starts off with Michael and his girl driving through this random forest in this busted looking Buick. What? On no cars like that, let me live when this happens. Honestly, we're out of gas. <laughs> 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 Why he's so happy, bro? We're out of gas. <laughs> Literally, bro. This is already strike one. Cause why are you so happy about this right now? So ultimately, they end up walking to somewhere I don't know. And while they're walking, Michael stops and asks his homegirl to officially be his girlfriend. And I mean, he is Michael Jackson, so she finna say yes regardless. But then he proceeds to immediately give her a promise ring off rip. Like, dang, bro, how long have y'all been officially together? A minute? Couldn't be me. But you do you, I guess. But now, this is where it gets juicy and the start of many violations to this poor woman. So Michael starts staring at her all creepy like and hits her with the famous line I'm not like other guys. Immediately cutting to the moon showing that Michael is about to transform into a wearable for some on some Twilight shoes. But bro, just hear the sound this dude makes as he's about to transform, bruh. They can't tell me that they weren't cracking up when Michael did that, bro. Why he sound like a chimp and a bird mixed together, bro? <laughs> yeah, too funny, bro. So he proceeds to transform, and looking back, the mid transformations are still nightmare fuel to this day. Just look at this nigga, bro. Ugh. So a few screams later, and Michael finally turns full werewolf and starts chasing his girl down. Like he is really trying Damn. to end her. This man Michael was a savage. So he inevitably catches her and pins her to the ground. And just when he's about to finish her off, boom! It's revealed that they were watching a horror movie the entire time, which is immediately followed up with one of the most iconic memes of our generation. Look at this guy. <laughs> this man Michael, he all like, like this nigga, he like me for real watching these scary movies, not gonna lie. So his girl's all scared and asks Michael if they can leave. But Michael is all like, hell no, nah. we're both literally the stars of this movie. But she ends up leaving anyway. But look at his face. This face right here is the face of Air Force energy ready to release. He will have his revenge. So Michael follows his girl outside the theater and starts telling her how scary she is. Like I would do to my own girl run. It's only a movie. It's not funny. That's Michael is like me for real, bro. Oh my gosh. I literally be saying it's only a movie. Babe, you know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm saying? It's only a movie. <laughs> Love you, babe. Then they start walking away from the movie that they both starred in and the music kicks in, cueing Michael to start singing and dancing around his girl trying to swoon her and junk. But bro, check out this step this man did. Junk got me hype. Look at Michael, bro. Oh, hold on. You see a little step? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see that step again. You try to scream. Ah, ah. <laughs> So they continue easing down the road and homegirl is really feeling it. No joke. But nah, me and MJ are really one and the same. No cap. Bro, Michael is like me for real, bro. That's how I be with my girl, bro. I call that's how I be. We just chill walking the gate. I'm just over here just always like singing and dancing and junk. She all like, oh my God. You know what I'm saying? He like me for real. Let me be honest. I'm being honest. Yes, sir. 
So as Michael and his girl keep walking, they walk past a random graveyard. And I'm like, let's be honest here. Why the heck are they over here this late at night? Where are y'all going? Another strike, Mike, you tripping. But right after they pass the cemetery, all these zombies start rising from their graves while homie is narrating evilly in my ears. Oh, and the credits say that this was rapping, by the way. What? Just want to throw that out there. But anyways, just look at these zombies. They still look just as realistically ugly as I remember. So inevitably, all the zombies surround Mike and his girl, leading them with nowhere to go. But for real though, where the heck was y'all going anyways? I'm confused. So, as the zombies get closer and closer, MJ's girl slowly looks over and... <laughs> why did he turn into a zombie? Like, why though? Why he doing her like this, bro? He really just... He on demon time for real in this video, bro. He tripping. Trust me, the violation gets even worse later on. So like the video if you're enjoying so far, you dig? So then, Michael starts dancing with all the zombies, basically planning this whole thing from the get-go. This man, bro. But check the moves, though. Like, Heike, you got some explaining to do after this, Michael. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey! <laughs> Here we go with the head turn, bro. So Michael and the zombies continue to dance, doing all the iconic moves we all know and love, until this happens. Oh, well, he got hemorrhoids, what the heck? How the hell he just turned back? What the freak? Where his girl at? Like, how's she feeling right now? We're all weird surrounded, and then my boyfriend just randomly just turns into a zombies and they start dancing. Like, Michael, you have some explaining to do. If if she don't break up with you after this, it's, it's, it's I don't, I don't understand. I'm saying, cause this makes no sense. So after some more fire dancing, it finally cuts to his girl running away. Bro, where was she at the whole time Michael and them were dancing? You would think he was still trying to swoon her or some shiz, but I guess she really wasn't feeling it. No shulk. I know I already used that joke. So, homegirl ends up retreating into this Scooby Doo ass haunted house while Michael and the zombies chase after her. But once she gets in the house, the first thing she does is put a small chair in front of the door, like that's gonna do something. And then the zombies start breaking through the windows and under the floorboards. Like, how did y'all have time to get under there? These must have been recently revived zombies, cause ain't Wait, no, no way, way bruh. But nah, look at how this man Michael enters the house though. Look at this man. <laughs> Dang, bro, chill. <laughs> like golly, Michael, I thought you loved this girl, man. Nigga ain't playing. So Michael and the zombie continue to move closer to her very, very slowly, literally about to rest and peace her when Come on, I'll take you home. Yup, it was all a dream. But check it though, you wake your girl up and she immediately screams in utter terror and you over here smiling? This man Michael was demented, bruh. Just look at her face. She like, is this nigga serious right now? So Michael helps her up and you would think things will be good, right? Look at this, bruh, look at this part. Dang, bro, like, oh what the, f <laughs> this man won't give her a break. He's Freddy Krueger over here in her dreams, bro. I feel so bad for her, man. Michael, what did she do to you? Dude really trapped her in again, Jutsu, I'm dead. Subscribe to save this girl's life, please.